on the property as they are sensitive to the cold. Unfortunately, as today is quite chilly, some of our smaller primates, such as our lemurs, may be more likely to be found inside their heated barns instead of out for us to see. But hopefully we'll be able to see a few of our other primate species. Yeah, she said something in the small one enough. Yeah. Oh, there is one. Ooh. What is this the guy doing here? You're probably uh, coming out. Oh, there's old geese. They're not even out. It's too cold. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoy the ride, bro. Yeah, only the geese is in there. Where's the monkey? Oh, over there! So over way over to our right, you might get a little sneak peek at two of our spider monkeys. We'll be getting a better view of these guys just as we pass the other side of the island. Yeah, those are just... What the heck? <laughs> what the heck? one. So like I said on this island we do have those two spider monkeys. So the all black one his name is Flip and he is a robust black spider monkey and the one's a rusty brown in color his name is Bieber and he's a black handed spider monkey. Now both these guys have specially adapted for life in the trees having long slender limbs as well as a prehensile tail that acts as a fifth limb. Their tail actually has a hairless patch of skin right near the tip with grooves like a fingerprint and this enhances their ability to grasp onto leaves and branches. Their hands also lack thumbs allowing them to move through the trees with great speed and agility. Now both these species are mainly found throughout Mexico, Panama, and Ecuador. The Flip and Beaver here are best friends so you'll rarely see them apart. On cold days like today they love sitting on top of those wooden platforms cuddling each other but they can also be found chasing each other up and down the island. Oh, I see a chunky monkey. These monkeys are cool. Yes, that's it. Is that just all of the monkeys? It feels so short. The lake that we are currently touring on is a natural spring-fed lake with man-made islands designed to host each one of our primate species. The lake is home to four different types of fish, the large and smallmouth bass, sunfish, and catfish, as well as snakes, frogs, muskrats, panda turtles, and snapping turtles. The deepest part of the lake is only about seven to eight feet deep right in the center. That's not bad. Maybe feel like that. Leave him alone, bro. Oh, I thought there would be more monkeys. That's it. I guess that's it. There's nothing really. They're all hiding. Yeah. I can't see. Too bad. Just writing about it.
so if you look to the island directly in front of us, just at the entranceway yes. of the shed, you'll be able to see one of our white-handed gibbons. The gibbons are native to Southeast Asia. I'm going to try my soon to see lesser apes. You can also see another one if you look over to the left-hand side of the island, sitting on one of the wooden platforms. So these guys have adapted very differently to life in the trees than those two spider monkeys we saw earlier. These guys have hook-like hands, short thumbs, long arms, compact bodies, but actually don't have any tails. They normally live in family groups, which is what we have here. There's a mother, Gina, father, Alfonso, and they live on the island with their son, Sylvester, who was born here at the park in 2018. Mm -hmm. you see them yeah, yeah, yeah. These guys are famous for their loud whooping like alarm calls that you'll hear them make very loudly every day here at around 11 to 12 p.m. All three of them will participate in this territorial call. Yes, that's it. Just the geese. As we approach the docking area, I ask once again that everyone please remain seated with your arms and legs within the boat until we have come to a full and complete stop. I have secured the docking area and opened up the gates for you. Once the gates are open, you are then welcome to exit to your right hand side. If you have any questions about the tour or the safari in general, I'd be happy to. So if you look to the island directly in front of us, just at the entranceway yes. of the shed, you'll be able to see one of our white-handed gibbons. The gibbons are native to Southeast Asia. I'm going to try my soon to see lesser apes. You can also see another one if you look over to the left-hand side of the island, sitting on one of the wooden platforms. So these guys have adapted very differently to life in the trees than those two spider monkeys we saw earlier. These guys have hook-like hands, short thumbs, long arms, compact bodies, but actually don't have any tails. They normally live in family groups, which is what we have here. There's a mother, Gina, father, Alfonso, and they live on the island with their son, Sylvester, who was born here at the park in 2018. Mm -hmm. you see them as well? yeah, yeah, yeah. These guys are famous for their loud whooping like alarm calls that you'll hear them make very loudly every day here at around 11 to 12 p.m. All three of them will participate in this territorial call. Where's Kellen? Okay, I'm ready over here. <laughs> Yeah, it's alright. I can see it from here. Is it ending or can we walk by the way around? That's the end. No, there's no. Look how huge that one is. Oh my god. Yeah, What's that in there thing? Oh, this is the winter fur. Oh, yeah, the, the fur. Sorry. It's 
so in the winter they have this around. See this guy flies around <laughs> us. It's going in front. Nice! Oh look at him, I need your cheese. Oh my god. He's going right on my side. Oh, he's gonna get a drink. Mm-hmm.